hanging out at the Young Hollywood studio with Sterling Knight. Uh, now, we were hanging out a couple months ago at the yeah, Laker we game. Yeah, we did. And our Lakers won. Always. We're the best. I know, you right? Can't, you can't touch us, dude. I know, we gotta talk about Miami since that's what everyone's um, talking about. Jeez. Are the Lakers gonna pull it off next year? Here's what I here's what I really want to see, and I don't think this will happen, but I want to see Miami and Cleveland play oh. for the Eastern Conference Finals. I want Cleveland to beat them, and then I want the Lakers to destroy Cleveland in the Finals. In However, theory, it sounds great, but who does Cleveland have? That's going to be the problem. Well, that, yeah. Who's even on the team now? They don't have a team, as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. Sorry, Cleveland. I love you. <laughs> so let's talk about all the cool things you're doing. So Sunny with a chance. Yeah. Okay, girls, 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 girls. Look at what you love. Look at what you love. <laughs> One of the top shows, Disney Channel. Like, don't how, how's that feeling? Just like, you're on one of the top shows now I mean, on I don't, TV. I don't know how, I mean, I try not to get caught up in all of that. Uh, you know, as far as I'm concerned, I'm working, which I'm very, very grateful for, because I remember not working and that was horrifying. And, um, you know, I'm learning a lot and I'm having fun. So, you know, it, the fact that it's doing well is just icing on the cake. And when you're on hiatus like right now, what, what are things you're doing? Trying to get another job. Nice. Yeah, yeah, I gotta keep it pushing. Did you ever run the, like, when you're in the off season and you're out and mm -hmm. people recognize you, which I'm sure happens a well, lot, but they think you're the character <clears throat> where you're kind of not the nicest guy sometimes. Does it's, that ever happen to you? Yeah, absolutely. I actually got yelled at um, in, in an airport one time. This, this cute little girl, um, she comes up to me and she grabs me by the shirt and turns me around and I'm like, whoa. And she's like, why are you so mean to Sonny? Hey, Chad, I've got good news for you. How can there be good news when I've only got 800,000 fans? And I'm like, this is so cute. And she's like, you know, eight or nine or something like that. And they don't really understand the difference of the character or whatever. And I was like, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm supposed to. Like, it's, you know, I'm just pretending. It's, it's not really like, and she just refused to believe that. She was like, no, you are mean. Stop being so mean to Sunny. She's a nice girl and she likes you. And I'm like, this is so cute. So it finally happened, that was it? Yeah, no, it ha yeah, she just yelled at me and the mom came over and apologized. And I was like, no, please, this is great. And, uh, you know, we took a picture and then she was like, you're not that mean right now. And I was like, um, <laughs> I'm not that mean person, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's talk about some of the fun things you're doing on the set. Tiffany Thornton said you have a, a fan thing for John Mayer, that you're you're a big John yeah. Mayer fan. <laughs> I'm, we I'm, hear you break in a song just randomly, yeah? Absolutely. Um, you know, John Mayer's my, my, my man crush. Everybody, every, wow. every guy's gotta have their man crush. It's, it's 2010, let's get over it. John Mayer's mine. That why John Mayer, everybody out there? Why he is so him? talented. I mean, I, as far as I'm concerned, this is borderline one of the greatest guitar players on the planet right sure. now. And he's all, in my opinion, he's one of the most underrated. Um, most people I talk to don't know about like his Tri album with John Mayer Trio. Yeah. Insane, like Pino Palladino and Steve Jordan, like just destroying Jimi Hendrix covers. And it was just, he's so good. So you really just break out into a, a John Mayer song? Well, really? only when I'm trying to pick up girls. Ah, <laughs> what doesn't, the other? <laughs> it doesn't work at all. Don't try that. It, it's not a good look. And what else? Talk to us when you're just on the set hanging out. We hear there like some talents you have. There's like a, a clover thing you're doing with your tongue or something. How does even, that work? I don't know where this thing started. Like, Is everyone, that true or it's not? No, true? I mean I can do it. It's like, it's like a you know how you can roll your tongue up in like the taco and then you just. Hey, let's see. Can okay. you do it real quick? Hold on, hold on. We gotta zoom in on this. Uh, that's the talent. Well, no, no, that's the taco, and then okay. you take you take that, and then just like pull it back, and it it turns into this. So it's like it doesn't it doesn't do me any good. Talented. It's not, it's not even attractive. <laughs> All right, last thing, because there are a lot of you know people out there. Their dream is to be on a Disney show. Yeah. And just what advice do you have <clears> to, to those kids out there that are just trying to figure out how do you break through the clutter? You know, you, just, you hear no a thousand times before someone you know takes a chance on you and says yes. I mean, you just gotta. Stay driven and stay focused and um, you know, take it for what it is. There you go, Sterling Knight, Sunny with a Chance, and there's a new episode that everyone needs to check out. That's really funny. Uh, my character Chad starts losing fans on Flitter. So um, I start losing my fans and I start freaking out. Oh no! No, it's dropping! I'm, I'm sorry! I'm sorry! I didn't mean to yell at you! <laughs> come, come back! Come back! See, maybe you'll need to start being nicer so that little girl doesn't come <laughs> after you and say, Why are you so mean, right? That's why I lost the fans. They found out I was mean. There you go. <laughs>